got it, yeah. You'll see it soon enough. I just need to get home. Look, I can't talk now. I just, I gotta go. Excuse me? Sir? Ladies and gentlemen. Sir? Pilots turn on the fastened seatbelt sign. Please return to your seats with your seatbelts fastened. Sir, you need to go! <laughs> What was that? Am I seeing ghosts? Jeez, you startled me. Is there anyone with you? I'm fine. I just need to be alone. Please just go away. What's wrong? You look fine to me. You probably hit your head in the crash. I don't know, and I can't help you find it right now. Look, here's some water. Now please, leave me alone. something from me. Some water? Do you have juice? Not here, but I'll make sure you get some during the flight. Let's go, sweetheart.
Is there anything I can do for you? I could use a whiskey. And you can tell me what that's all about. It's very exciting. We have a fugitive on board today. Should I be worried? She's in safe hands. Now, I'll be right back with that drink. And don't forget to fasten your seatbelt. Shall I store your camera and laptop before takeoff? Kate was in handcuffs. She's a convict. Don't worry. I won't tell anyone about the handcuffs. What handcuffs? The ones you were wearing on the plane. Thought you couldn't remember anything. What do you say we keep this between you and me? Deal. If you agree to help me. Deal. You know the way to the crash site? I saw a dog around here. It must have been on the plane. Maybe it can lead you there. You're not coming? There's a marshal I'm trying to avoid. Hey, dog! Hey, dog! One minute we're bound for L.A., the next minute, this! How the hell should I know? We're lost! That's where! I've never met you, man. Look, I can't talk right now. Not now, man! Whoa! This whole plane could blow any second. We need to think of surviving right now. Let's skip the formalities. There'll be time for introductions later. Right now, you need to focus. I'm fine. Go help the others. man. It's all my fault. We're screwed. That's where we are. Um, no. Dude, our plane just crashed on a deserted island. We all need help. I can't breathe! 
This wasn't supposed to happen. I'm not supposed to be here. I don't, I don't know, but my baby, I have to be in Los Angeles tomorrow. I've never met you before. I just, I just, I just need to keep still. The fuel tank is ruptured. I need you to stop the leak before the whole thing explodes. You understand? Now go! I don't know. Listen, we need to help these people. We'll figure that out later. Right now, get to the plane. No, but I need you to help with that fuel leak. Yes, I told you. You need to stop that fuel leak before the whole plane goes up in flames. See that section near the jungle? The fuel leak's there. Move! Good job with a fuel leak. You saved a lot of lives. Name's Jack. Wish I could introduce myself, but I can't remember my name or my past. It's all gone. Let me take a look, okay? I don't see any signs of head injury. I'd say you're suffering from amnesia brought on by the crash. Do you know me? Maybe you saw me on the plane? Afraid not. But try finding your stuff. Luggage, carry-ons, anything that could help trigger your memory. How's the memory? There's wreckage scattered all over the beach. There was some turbulence. I looked back and saw the plane snap apart. Next thing I know, I blacked out. The pilot announced that we were heading back to Fiji. That's all I know. A few of us are gonna search for the cockpit. If it's intact, we should find the plane's transceiver. Send out a signal, help the rescue party find us. No? But try finding your personal stuff. Luggage, carry-on bags, anything that could help trigger your memories. Out in the jungle near the spot we met, 
I put it at the far end of the camp with some other luggage. It was terrible. I knew the tail was gone, but I couldn't bring myself to look back. And then... Then we ended up here. It feels like we're in the middle of nowhere. I don't know. I haven't seen him since we crashed. And I hope I never do again. I'm sure they're coming. Keep moving, Scruffy. I ain't interested. We need to start thinking survival. Instead, we got a doctor wasting medicine on folks who ain't got a chance. Ain't no room for bleeding hearts now. How in the hell should I know? You'd best brush up on your Lord of the Flies there, Ralphie. Rescue ain't coming. Well, ain't you the lucky one? I'm from Armpit, Alabama. Any more dumbass questions? Don't know, don't care. Me? I'm the guy who's about to put his boot up your butt if you don't stop asking questions. Yeah, see that big ass plane sticking out of the sand? Try looking there. the camera. Where is the camera? Look! Somebody is being attacked! Hey, leave it alone! I'm going to destroy that photo. Then I'm going to kill you. Previously on Lost. I don't see any signs of head injury. I'd say you're suffering from amnesia brought on by the crash. Where is the camera? <gasps> I'm going to destroy that photo. Then I'm going to kill you.
monster. Hey, stranger. You don't look any worse for wear. You might want to try the cockpit in the jungle, but watch yourself. That thing out there seemed pretty mad. And good luck getting past Jack. He's not letting anyone out there. I didn't see it. Too busy running for my life. I don't know where we are, but I've never heard anything like that thing before. I saw that guy in the terminal before we left. He was looking for someone. Guess that someone was you. We found it a few miles from the beach. You'll see some plane wreckage. Just follow that and you should find it. Hey, champ, you plug your brain hole yet? Maybe, but this is a trade and barter system. What do you got for me? Maybe it was a polar bear. How the hell should I know? All I saw was some beady-eyed guy hightail it into the jungle. How in the hell should I know? I don't know, but the plane breaks apart like a twig, and no one suspects the one Iraqi on board? Why don't you mind your own memories, nosy? What do you want?
but no refunds. Take her easy. Where do you think you're going? Are you trying to get yourself killed? I don't know. He took off into the jungle before I got a good look. There were no survivors. It's a tomb now. Just forget about going there. I don't know what it was, but we're all staying put for now. Look, I understand that camera could help with your memories, but I'm not letting you risk your life to find it. all coming back. I can't believe you're taking photos for the travel section. Who'd you piss off at the newspaper this time? Hurry up and get the photo or I'm running away with this fisherman. for wedding photos that were quicker than you. I finally received word. Savo's gonna be in Australia next week. After all these years, I'm so close to finally catching him red-handed. I can't believe it. And it breaks my heart, but I need to keep this secret. As much as I love my man, he won't be able to resist the idea of getting involved. I can't have him ruin my chance at Salvo. My God, don't tell me you wore white. Oh, please. So long as I'm with you, I'll forever be a bridesmaid. <laughs> and I'll always be your best man. <laughs> I want to go see that island, but we'll need that boat to get there. The old man looks pretty attached. I know how to get past him. Shuai dai! Mi puing! Ya pinha! Tisut na tamachat! Ryo yak shuai! Leo leo! You speak Thai? Dioni, dek dek. What the hell did you say to him? Let's just say men are suckers for a damsel in distress. Come on, Romeo. You can woo me some more on the ride over. She tricked the fisherman. She lied to him. She lied. Find any more of your stuff? Oh my god, I hope she's okay. Did you tell Jack? You're the guy with amnesia, right? Jack told me about you. I'm Claire. Yeah, the pregnant girl. 
No, I'm sorry, I haven't. But Kate and some others found another part of the plane. Maybe it's there? I don't know, and I do not want to find out. Now everyone's been even more protective of the pregnant girl. What are you talking about? I feel fine. I wish everyone would just stop worrying about me. We have to be. I, I can't have this baby now. Not alone on this island. Well, it's a man with no name. You looking to trade? What do you want me to do about it? Go find Jack. Where do you think you're going? Are you trying to get yourself killed? What? Is she okay? Stay here! Hey son, over here. I'm over here at the banyan trees. Hey son, over here. I'm over here at the banyan trees. Hey son, over here. I'm over here, at the banyan trees. Hey son, over here. I'm over here, at the banyan trees. I'm betting you didn't get permission from Jack to be here. They're called banyan trees. They're very sturdy. I don't know what's out there, but these trees look like they'll provide good protection. Not sure, but there's a reason for everything now, isn't there? I don't think we're meant to be rescued. There's some plane debris through the jungle. That'll lead you to the cockpit. I'm out here for my own reasons, and I'm sure you are too. There's plane debris scattered ahead that leads to the cockpit. Try looking there. I don't know what's in this jungle. I do know the banyan trees provide cover. Hide inside the hollowed roots and you should be safe.
I've got you in my sights. Let's try that again. You gotta come out sometime. <laughs> Right, man? I thought I heard gunfire. And then that monster. Yeah, you're not gonna make it through the cave unless you have some light. You need a couple torches? I'll trade you. Would I be building a raft if I thought rescue was coming? I'm not waiting. Sure didn't take you long to make enemies. This cave is messed up, man. And there's bats in there. They may be blind, but they're fast, so watch yourself. It's further ahead. The cave will lead you to it, but it's pitch black in there. Here, take this lighter. I'm gathering wood to build a raft. I'm not just sitting around waiting for rescue. I need to get my son home. Hey, man, what do you want? Nice doing business with you.
Whatever it is you're looking for, you won't find it here. Excuse me? We think you might be the one. What are you talking about? Who are you people? We're the good guys. Previously on Lost. Look, I understand that camera could help with your memories, but I'm not letting you risk your life to find it. And until we can figure out what attacked us, everyone stays on the beach. Who was that? Where is she from? We think you might be the one. Who are you people? We're the good guys. Dude, where you been? Hurley, what happened? Where'd they go? Where'd who go? There were some people. They attacked me. Again? Someone's got it out for you, dude. Guess so. Well, you were AWOL, we were attacked too. Steve, or wait, Scott? They found him like dead with every bone in his body broken. And someone stuck Claire with a needle. They used a needle on me too. I gotta figure out who the hell I am. Good idea, cause Jack doesn't trust you and neither does Claire. Everyone's starting to wonder. They think you might be one of them. Good news. No one's been killed or kidnapped in the last five minutes. You got problems. Dude, maybe you were a paparazzi guy. That would explain the amnesia. You must have took one too many punches to the head. Hey, that's great. You should take that to Saeed, the Republican guard dude. He seems to know electronics and stuff. Well, I'm kind of cursed. I was in Australia because I thought I'd found a way to stop the curse. Then on my way back, I'm late for the flight, but I made it. Lucky, huh? And then I land here. Dude, I'm totally cursed. Probably the same dudes who attacked you. Um, I don't know. She's okay, I guess, if you like hanging around with fugitives. I hear you have found a laptop. I know. It has caused a great deal of suspicion in the camp. You are a photographer. I wonder what it was you were photographing. Whatever it was, the man attacking you seemed most interested. Let me see it. Your battery is dead. Go see John Locke. He said he found laptop batteries among the luggage. I'll be able to power up from that. Then we can see the extent of the damage. That is my own business. I do not know, but I do know this. They are dangerous, and this is their island, not ours. I have never met you before, and I never forget a face. Even with satellite imaging, it is unlikely that they will find us. Satellites need to know where to look, and we were a thousand miles off course when we crashed.
You know, for a man with no identity, you're making quite a name for yourself around camp. And was it worth risking your life? You don't need a battery, because you don't need the laptop. This island is a fresh start, brand spanking new. I've met Locke before. What's different about him? Yes, I remember. She's still here, mate. Wait till she's gone. Go watch from the window over there. She can't see you. Let's have it, Rico. My newspaper paid you good money for that information. I want it now. Look, Gelborn. Gelhorn. Lisa Gelhorn. I told you, sweetie. I ain't got nothing yet. Come back later. Yeah, I'll come back. And you'll have the info, or I'll have your ass. Oh, I should only be so lucky. Come on, fella. We're closing, and I ain't buying what you're selling. Look, it's top-of-the-line camping gear. Brand spanking new. I can't move it. What'd you buy it for in the first place? It's not like you'll be able to do a lot of camping. Don't tell me what I can't do. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello, Rico. This is Ms. Gelhorn. It's imperative that I receive the package today. If money is the issue, I'm willing to raise my offer. I'll see you shortly. So, Lisa Gellhorn. I heard you two used to be an item. Yeah, she was my moral compass. Means I was always wrong. You got what I came for or not? You want the dirt on Savo? I got it. And he's got a lot to hide. Blokes with secrets. They're a valuable commodity. Locke was in a wheelchair. He couldn't walk before. A wheelchair. Sneaking around at night might raise suspicions. You must have me mistaken for someone else. Cut the crap. Ever heard of Rico's Pawn Shop? Yeah, I saw you. You and your wheel. All right, I hear you. If you want to keep that news flash from the whole camp, you'll give me the batteries. I'll give you what you need. Stock up on supplies. I'll meet you at the tree line. You sure you want to remember? It's who you are now that counts. Sorry, never heard of her. When I got on that plane in Sydney, I was in hell. Now, well now everything has changed. Let's not forget that before we crashed here, we were all strangers. Any one of us could be one of them. We're not the only people on this island. Charlie's trying to find his way, just like you.
There are markings on the trees. Follow them and you'll get your batteries. I'll meet you there. Others, others. Nan Yong or Mote Eight to fifteen Pingi Son, none of where nigh anyone is on Nadar Murubogo in Nunga. Others, Namo is so, others. Let's try that again. I need to get my bearings. Looks like you've discovered another one of my secrets. Perfect. That's why I get the big bucks. You have a nose for trouble, don't you? The French poet René Char once said, for those who are walled up, everything is a wall, even an open door. He could have been talking about you, son. I told you, we're not the only ones on this island. I've tried everything. Rocks, the trebuchet, it's completely sealed. Your guess is as good as mine. This island is different. It's special. The island gave me my legs back. I am. Come with me. Right this way.
perfect. That's why I get the big bucks. This place holds answers. This place can provide answers, but you might not like what you see. Joseph Campbell once said, it is by going down into the abyss that you recover the treasures of life. You're the only one. I'll meet you on the other side. Can't say I blame them. They were here first. Only what you take with you.
Everything that happens on this island happens for a reason. What did you find? Locke, help me up. Tell me what you found in there. I saw a woman, Lisa. Locke, pull me up. In your hand, what did you find? Help me up and I'll show you. Right now I see no reason to let you up. But I might have a few reasons to keep you down there. I found a compass. Throw it up. Locke, there's no time. All right. Grab my hand. Looks like today was your lucky day. But I'm sure that when you're ready, it'll find you. One battery for your troubles. I'm starting to think this battery didn't exist. The island provides. Now, what about this compass? Via Domus. That's Latin. It means the way home. Very interesting. The island gave me that hat you saw. It's mine to share when the time is right. And it looks like the island gave you that compass. Follow it. You may find the answers you're looking for. Previously on Lost. Let's have it, Rico. My newspaper paid you good money for that information. I want it now. You've got a hell of a lot of explaining to do. Dead laptop's about as useful as a coffee maker on this island. Get Saeed to fix it. I hear you have found a laptop. Looks, Looks like, like you've discovered another one of my secrets. Everything that happens on this island happens for a reason. Via Domus. That's Latin. It means the way home. Let me guess. You got a question. We've blown open the hatch. He's near the second entrance we found to the hatch. Yeah, he's on our side.
You already know the answer to that, remember? There was a $23,000 reward on my head. I've seen a lot of strange things on this island. I know he doesn't trust you. A pantry full of food. Too wide. Zoom in closer. Perfect. That's why I get the big bucks. Four, eight, we're dead. Fifteen, doomed and dead. Dude, you don't want to know. Dynamite in the hatch? Bad. Trust me, that place is a death hole. Do not go in there. He's gone to the hatch. I warned him about the numbers. Did they listen? No. The silence evil, dude. I don't want to sound dramatic or nothing, but we're all gonna die. Saeed's cool, just don't pick a fight with him. He knows, like, top secret torture stuff. Charlie's a good guy. The dude is in a rock band, but they were a one-hit wonder. I brought it down, dude. It's like, all my fault. He's got father issues. That's where the numbers are, dude. Stay away from there. The numbers are a curse. They'll destroy your life, man. I wish I never heard them. I think the natives are stirring. Hello. I don't know. He's in the jungle somewhere. I was traveling to America on a business trip with my husband. Jack is suspicious of you. He went out on the raft to try and find rescue. I know he will succeed. I trust Kate. And she seems to trust you. Are you one of them? Shoots, he scores. Did you hear the news? Sawyer, Michael, and Jin are off on another adventure. The big hero set out on a raft to look for rescue. If you need anything, I can help you, mate. I don't know, but Jack's all cryptic and such. Can't get a straight answer. As usual, we're not included on their A-team mission. I've not seen him. He's probably off building a radio out of coconuts. Saeed is tough, but he's fair. Of course I do. I was in drive shaft. Played bass guitar, did some backing vocals. I was in Sydney visiting my brother, Liam. I'm putting our band back together. When we get rescued, we're going to be huge. Kate doesn't go for guys like you and me. Jack or Sawyer, maybe. Jack likes to be the hero. Jack, Kate, John. They like to go trotting off into the jungle to play superheroes. How can I help you?
splendid. Thank you and come again. Perfect. That's why I get the big bucks. Things have changed on the island, son. You need to watch yourself. Do you think we crashed here by coincidence? This is no ordinary place. Each one of us was brought here for a reason. That's why you need to remember who you are. He's a man of science. I'm a man of faith. Question is, what kind of man are you? Saeed's anxious to uncover your identity. He and Jack are running out of patience with you. We've opened the hatch. At the hatch, you should give him that battery. I know he's anxious to look at your laptop. Too wide. Zoom in closer. He shoots, he scores.
Let's make a deal. Any time I can help. I'm open for business. Any time I can help.
What did one snowman say to the other snowman? I'm not one of the hostiles, if that's what you mean. Hi, Jack. I met him when he hurt his foot running the stadium steps in Los Angeles. Now he's here. It's a small world, isn't it? Everything I know is written on his walls. See for yourself. And read the diary, next to Ton of the Screw. Haven't you heard? I'm the fool who's been pushing a button for the last three years. Name's Desmond. Snow Hatch is a bloody crypt. Take my advice. Turn around and go back, brother. I'd rather die running than live one more minute in that place. You don't know. 4, 8, 15, 16, 23, 42. Now it's your turn, brother. Nothing. I hear you have found a battery. We were able to acquire explosives in the jungle. You do not need to know the details. He has lived in extreme conditions for a very long time. Who knows what effect the isolation has had on his brain. I should be able to use this battery to power your laptop. Soon we will have answers. But I cannot let you enter the hatch until you can tell me your name. I'm sorry, but we don't know who you are. I'll work on your laptop. In the meantime, this is the passenger manifest. If you can prove your name is on it, we will know you are not one of the hostels, and then you can enter the hatch. You'll be allowed to enter once I can verify who you are. Nothing. Things have changed on the island, son. You need to watch yourself. 
The manifest tells us who we used to be, but not who we are now. Afraid not. Let me guess. You got a question. Not much. Except that if you're not on it, you're gonna be in a lot of trouble. I haven't. But you'd better find out who you are, fast. Jack is getting more and more suspicious of you. If you're not on it, then you might be one of them. Sorry, I have not. I do not know anything about it. Dave was right. We're all gonna die. The Manifest does like three things. It tells us who's alive, who's dead, and who wasn't on the plane. You learn your name, and it'll tell everyone if you were on the plane or not. Dude, we've been out here for I don't know how long. Anything resembling civilization is gone. What I wouldn't give to be back in Sydney, the Hotel Persephone. What's my name? Surveillance from the 16th of August 2004. Zoran Savo on a long distance call with an unidentified male. Thank you for the payment, Mr. Savo. Are we in agreement for the rest? Yes, upon delivery. All that remains is the issue of transporting the nerve agent out of the country. Not a problem. My team is ironing out the details. Where's the rest? Quid pro quo. Three shots of your ex-wife. Caught in a net. Next time, hire a private dick. You're saving me a ton in alimony. Cough it up. Suite 42, Hotel Persephone. Tonight. Savo's cooking a deal. You snap the photo, you'll land the front page of every rag on the globe. Just watch yourself, mate. These blokes find you. They'll kill you. All that matters is the photo. All that matters is the photo? 
That was my story. Not yours. You're a son of a bitch, Elliot Maslow. You'd screw anyone to further your career. I'm just trying to keep up with you, sweetheart. My name is Elliot Maslow. Of course, Elliot. And that was how I got the nickname Hurley. Dude, were you even listening to me? You remembered? Sweet. Maybe I should tell more people my nickname story. Let me guess. You got a question. Elliot, huh? I kind of took you for a nick, but I guess Elliot will work. Nice to meet you, Elliot. My name is Sun. About bloody time. Pleased to know you, Elliot. Nothing yet, but I intend to find out. How can I help you? Custom. I'll be here if you need me. Things have changed on the island, son. You need to watch yourself. You may know your name, but do you know yourself? The encryption on your laptop is quite advanced. This is most unusual. If you enter the hatch, you must take responsibility for the numbers. It's time to show you can be trusted. There is a computer. You need to enter the numbers 4, 8, 15, 16, 23, 42 in sequence when the counter starts. It's very important that you stay on top of this. In the meantime, I'll continue to work on your laptop. We may learn who you are yet. Yes. There is an Elliot Maslow on this list. American national returning to Los Angeles. You are now officially a survivor of Flight 815. Welcome, Elliot. If you enter the hatch, 
You must take responsibility for the numbers. It's time to show you can be trusted. Elliot! What happened? What did you do? Damn it! I, I didn't do anything! Try and find a way to open the door. I'll go to get help. And remember, if the counter starts beeping, you must enter the numbers. Perfect. That's why I get the big bucks. Need to zoom closer. Perfect. That's why I get the big bucks.
Not quite. Not quite. Perfect. That's why I get the big bucks. Too wide. Zoom in closer. He shoots, he scores. Nothing. Not quite.
need to zoom closer. Too wide. Zoom in closer. I need to zoom closer. He shoots, he scores. Where do you think you're going? Jack, you won't believe what I found. Elliot Maslow. If that is your real name. What's going on? Shut up! I was able to decrypt your laptop. And do you know what I found? I found that you have very good reasons to forget. What's on there? Would you care to explain why your laptop contains surveillance maps and a list of illegal weapons? C4, sarin gas. I think your amnesia is a lie. I think everything you've said is a lie. We're done giving you the benefit of the doubt. Why don't you start by telling us who you really are? Previously on Lost. Where is the camera? Hey! What the? We think you might be the one. You snap the photo, you'll land the front page of every rag on the globe. That was my story, not yours. You're a son of a bitch, Elliot Maslow. Would you care to explain why your laptop contains surveillance maps and a list of illegal weapons? Why don't you start by telling us who you really are? Are you all right, Elliot? Only a few hours. I think Jack and Saeed might have gone too far this time. I'm sorry, Elliot. I can't. Your laptop doesn't look good. It has lists of nerve agents and human test subjects, and these maps of some place called Chenchi. Chenchi. What was I doing with this stuff? Yeah. 
That was it. One moment, sir. Let's go. No messages, sir. studies with the twins. I want you to divert the press. What about the security breach at the Institute? It's of no consequence. They won't be able to decipher our research on the Sixth Sense anyway. Back off, mate. You're lousy undercover, Maslow. You know how easy it is to follow you. What are you doing here? What am I doing here? Don't forget whose story you stole. <laughs> Don't pull the morality card on me. You're unethical. Since when did you become Mother Teresa? Get off your high horse. It's the name of the game. You know it and I know it. Besides, all's fair in love and journalism, right? My god, Elliot, listen to yourself. This is personal for me and you know it. I've been tracking Savo for so long. I know he killed my sister. What do you want me to do? Walk away? Of course not. I want your help. If we work together, we can get past that guard, up to his room, and get photos of what he's doing. Where are your priorities, Elliot? Do the right thing for once in your life. You in? I'm in. Hold my laptop. I'm gonna distract the guard so you can get upstairs. Just like old times. Don't spout cliches. Let's just nail this bastard. Journalist, I'm chasing a story. What's this stuff on your laptop? I was a journalist, Kate. Think about it. Saeed didn't find weapons in my computer. He found information. Data. I don't know, Elliot. All that to track a story? It looks really bad. I don't know everything yet, but it's coming, Kate. Just give me a little more time. Deal? Shoots, he scores.
You okay? I'm on numbers duty. You don't need to stick around. You've always been honest with me, and I don't think you're any more dangerous than the rest of us. Trouble is, you haven't always been honest with Jack. Join the club. I guess the only thing worse than forgetting our past is remembering it. I knew there was no point in locking you up. Jack saw differently. It's too dangerous. That button must be pushed. It's our responsibility now. Desmond spoke of hostiles, and I'm sure those hostiles are the ones who have been shooting at us. I'm glad to see that you are out. I never agreed with her decision to lock you up. That's not a good idea. Hurley told me it is very dangerous. My place is here, waiting for my husband. Why? Do you believe we are being punished? My hope is with my husband on the raft. Trust is something that takes time to earn, Elliot. Got a get out of jail free card? 
Maybe you should try Locke. I hear he lit the fuse that blew open the hatch. There's an impressive music collection down there, but no drive shaft. No wonder that guy went mental. Early, great guy. But get this, it claims to have won some multi-million dollar lottery back home by playing the numbers. You are everybody! You are everybody! You are everybody! How can I help you? Anything I can do to help? Be sure to visit my other store in Piccadilly. Dude, where you been? I don't know about that place, dude. There's like this magnetic wall, and every time I go by, my teeth hurt. It's where, like, all these people got sick. Rousseau told us this guy on her team, Montand, lost his arm there. And it's where Arts blew up. This may sound crazy, but I'm worth over 150 million. I won the lottery, playing the numbers, then it started happening. My grandfather died, my mom's house burned down, my girlfriend ran off with my best friend, even poor Trisha Tanaka got hit by a meteor, all because of me. You can diss the Dharma dudes all you want, but they made some tasty cookies. There's dynamite at the Black Rock. Just head to the hatch, then follow the black flag through the dark territory. That stuff's dangerous, dude. We got covered in arts because of it. Don't say I didn't warn you. Better retrace my steps. Let's try that again. Damn, I'm good.
need to get my bearings. Shoots, he scores. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
previously unlost. Suite 42, Hotel Persephone. Tonight, Savo's cooking a deal. I've been tracking Savo for so long. If we work together, we can get past that guard, up to his room, and get photos of what he's doing. Via Domus. That's Latin. It means the way home. between these pylons and you'll be dead, Elliot. I'm here to help you. My name is Juliet, and whatever you might think of us, you need to know we are not all the same. It's a security perimeter to keep people out and in. Yeah, sorry about that. We needed a DNA sample. Because I can help you remember. The night before you left on Oceanic 815, Lisa Gellhorn's body was found in Sydney Harbor, shot dead. Elliot, you killed her. We know a lot about you. Much more than you do. 
Did I kill her? Too blurry. Of course, it's all coming back. Elevator's closed. Je suis son cliente. J'aimerais accéder à ma chambre. Elevator. Closed. Elevators closed. Time to buy a watch, mate. Do I look like I've been trained in customer service? Bugger off. That guy's no Thai fisherman. He says he's in Australia to promote his institute's humanitarian work, but he's after a nerve agent. His company's using it for some awful experiments. He's killing people, Elliot. Thailand's got bittersweet memories, Elliot. There are no second chances, Elliot. Let's just do the right thing here. Let's get Savo. That part of our lives is over. Joanne was on a student scholarship to Savo's research institute. She must have discovered what he was doing. That's why she was killed. There are so many things you don't know about me, Elliot. If only you'd taken the time to find out. Careful, Elliot. These aren't people you mess with. One of us needs to run interference. Am I speaking freaking French to you? Le elevator, el closed. Well, I got a 45 that says it's closed. Now back off, mate. That woman over there? She's a journalist. You know that. I don't appreciate nosy reporters asking me busy questions. Who's this Savo she's on about anyway? You, let's go. Hey, let me go. Keep it quiet, sweetheart. What are you doing? Let go of me!
bodyguard. I didn't kill Lisa. Careful. Don't get too close to the fence. Because I think Ben's wrong about you, Elliot Maslow. Depends on how you look at it, Elliot. You betrayed her, and that's just as bad. But I read your file, and I think I understand what Lisa saw in you. Even if Ben doesn't. Shoots, he scores. He's Ben, the guy in charge. He wants you, Elliot. I'm not sure you're still the man he thinks you are, but that's for you to decide. What do you need?
There you go, Elliot. If you want more, just come see me.
to me. I saw his file on your desk. <laughs> you are as stupid as you are clumsy, and you as ballsy as you are ugly. I got a good feeling Maslow's coming, so uh, we'll just wait here together. his file on your desk. <laughs> you are as stupid as you are clumsy, and you as ballsy as you are ugly. I got a good feeling Maslow's coming, so uh, we'll just wait here together. I can do better. Not quite. Framing is off. I can do better. He shoots, he scores. Tell me what you know about Elliot Master. I'm certain I do not know what you are talking about. Mr. Maslow, you've just killed the one person on this island who knows you from your past. I just put the past behind me. I want answers. Now! All in good time. But for now, I must apologize.
previously unlost. That woman over there, she's a journalist. Hey, let me go. You, let's go. What are you doing? Let go of me! The night before you left on Oceanic 815, Lisa Gellhorn's body was found in Sydney Harbor, shot dead. You betrayed her, and that's just as bad. But I'm here to help you. You need to follow that, Elliot. I want answers. Now! All in good time. But for now, I must apologize. <laughs> Sweet dreams, Elliot. again, Elliot. but you're just full of questions. The important thing is that we were here before you. That makes you our guests, and you've already overstayed your welcome. You want to go home, don't you? I'll let you out of here if you can tell me one thing. What do you remember about Hanso and a girl named Lisa? Ben will explain things to you soon enough, but for now, you need to think back. Juliet's given you a shot, Elliot. A little cocktail to jog your memory. And so, was there a briefcase? Focus. I need to focus. Of course. It's all coming back. It was quite secure, I assure you. Not secure enough, Middlework. We found a journalist. Our cover story in the press should deflect any suspicion. You put more faith in the press than I do. I'll deal with the matter. Let's get down to business. Money has been wired to you. 
And as promised, the Saren. Sticky business, these biological experiments. The benefits outweigh the risks, I assure you. The Hanso Foundation has had great success altering the human mind. And we intend to build on your success, to further our own research with ESP. The results are encouraging thus far. Think of the possibilities. To the future, Fiebluk. Bring me the girl. Lisa, I betrayed her.
Recorded phone message dated September 23, 2004. Zoran Savo and Thomas Mittelberg, Sydney, Australia. Everything is shut down. That photographer knows everything. We go into damage control until things settle. Flight 815 disappeared into the Pacific. No one will ever find that photo. But I'm sure that Gellhorn woman left a trail. I've already been detained once by authorities, and I can't risk any more audits or accusations. I'm having my staff destroy all the research at the Institute. Everything must stop for a while. For you, maybe. But my work goes on. If you do what you're told. We know everything about you, Elliot. Like Lisa thought she could trust you? I've helped you all I can, Elliot. Now it's up to you. Same place you came from, Elliot. Home. We're giving you what you want. Way home. You made it. You didn't break any land speed records getting here, but we'll forgive you. You do your homework on your subjects, don't you? Well, I do my homework too. It's my home, Elliot, and I'll do whatever it takes to protect it. 
I arrived here after a twister picked up my house and dropped it here. Any other useless questions? Don't worry, you'll get your things back. Including that compass we gave you. <laughs> you didn't think you just happened to find that, did you? The good news is that the compass leads to a boat. And it will show you the way home, but first, you must do something for us. I need you to bring me Dr. Jack Shepard. Lead him to the Black Rock. I don't care how. Tom will be there to meet you. You do this, and we'll give you safe passage home. Because I can give you what you want, Elliot. I'm sure you'll figure something out, Elliot. Our people will take you to your camp now. Don't let me down, Elliot. You look like a man on a mission. Great. I'll tell Jack. Don't worry. I smooth things over. I think he's willing to give you the benefit of the doubt now. I've started remembering. And I found something that could be a way off the island. But I need Jack's help. I'm in. No way, Kate. It's too dangerous. Just me and Jack. I thought we trusted each other, Elliot. I don't want you involved. You're not coming and that's final. If this is the man you used to be, I'm sad to see you remember so much. Dude, you're back. Glad you're safe, man. Awesome. Now you just gotta get Jack on your side. He's down the beach doing his doctor thing. Cut to the chase, Chevy. You wanna trade or not? Yeah? Well, whoopity frickin' do. He's down the beach playing doctor. I ain't got all day. Deal's a deal. Come back soon, you hear? I still do not trust you, despite what Kate may think. Good. Now maybe you can explain what was on your computer so we can put the past behind us. He is down the beach, gathering his medical kit. Welcome back. 
Listen, Kate vouched for you, so I'm willing to give you a second chance. Usually takes some time, but you beat the odds. And you expect me to just trust you on this? It's at the Black Rock, but it's hard to explain. I think it's easier if you come see it. Okay, Elliot. Time to prove yourself once and for all. I'm gonna grab some things first, and I'll meet you at the Black Rock. What do you need, Elliot? make a decision. Turn left, arrive home. Turn right, get hit by a bus. Some call it fate, I call it bad luck. We will get home. I'm gonna make sure of it. Here, take this. Never know what surprises we might find out here. Live together, die alone. Gentlemen, nice of you to join us. You might want to lower that gun, Jack. It's not me you should be pointed at. Deal's a deal, Elliot. You brought us Jack, you can have your compass back. This is your way off the island? It gets even better, Jack. Look who we found snooping around following you too. Now, Jack, if you'll drop your gun and come with us, no one will get hurt. A pleasure doing business, Elliot. The compass is yours. You're free to go.
Who are you? And where is the man you were with? The one who turned you in? I'm here alone. There's been a misunderstanding. Loyalty? Isn't that sharp? Your colleague was willing to betray you so easily. Do you suppose he'd sacrifice himself for you? Get him! Time to make a decision, Elliot. You're used to making tough choices, aren't you, Elliot? Explosion's gonna attract attention. We've gotta go. Now. What about Elliot? He'll be fine once he comes to. We can't just leave him here. Why are you so concerned about this guy? I gave him a second chance and he still betrayed us. But then he saved us. We gotta take him with us. And how do you propose we do that? We can't drag him all the way back to the beach. You've dislocated your shoulder, and lifting him's only gonna make it worse. Elliot, come on. Wake up. I'm not leaving without him. Okay. Now listen to me. Grab his legs and we'll pull him away from here for now. We'll come back later with more help. Elliot, wake up. Elliot, listen to me. Kate, Jack, where are they? There's no time. Tom and the others are after you. You can still reach that boat. Just follow this path to a lagoon. Chart a heading of 325 and you'll get home. But hurry, Elliot. Ben radioed orders to destroy the boat. You've got less than two minutes before they reach it. How do I know this isn't another trap? I made a mistake listening to Ben. Here's your camera. Ben didn't want you to have it. But that photo of Lisa... If you get off this island, you can show everyone what really happened to her. Why are you doing this? Because Ben was wrong about you, Elliot Maslow. Now hurry, go! Looks like you found your way, Elliot. 
Well, I've come to know this island fairly well. Everything that happens, happens for a reason. The others call this island home, but they aren't the only ones. I've already been rescued. This island granted me a new lease on life. I've found my purpose. Why would I ever leave? I saw the name on the stern and figured you'd be coming soon enough. It's time for me to go. Nobody knows what really happened to Lisa. I've got to get the story out. We all have our path, Elliot. Mine's on this island. Yours is back home. Good luck, son. Lisa? Oh my god, we made it. We're alive. 